One sunny day, a butterfly named Bertie laid an egg on a leaf. Bertie flew away to find some food. The egg was left on the plant. A little while later, out of the egg pops a caterpillar. Hello, my name is Casper. I am very, very hungry after being in the egg for so long. What do you think Casper might eat? You're right. Casper eats the leaves of the plants and flowers. When Casper is full, he lies down with a big full belly. Did you ever lie down with a big full belly? What had you eaten? Then Casper makes a big brown shell around his body called a cocoon. This is made from silk that comes from the caterpillar's own body. Why do you think Casper made a cocoon? Exactly. He is much safer from animals that might want to eat him. What animals do you think might eat butterflies? Exactly. Snakes, rats and birds all eat butterflies. Have you ever seen a cocoon? Cocoons can be found on branches, bushes, or hidden in leaves or holes in the ground. Casper fell into a very deep sleep after all of his hard work. How long do you think he slept for? Casper was so tired he slept for a whole two weeks. What's the longest you have ever slept for? Casper woke up after his long sleep and felt very happy. He stretched out and yawned very widely. Can you stretch and yawn like Casper? As he stretched, Casper felt a funny feeling. He had wings. Casper was very confused. He flew away and found a big mirror. Casper looked into the mirror and couldn't believe his eyes. What do you think he saw? You're right. Casper was no longer a caterpillar. He was now a beautiful butterfly. Now let's all sing along. Pretty, pretty butterfly, that's how you 
How does a caterpillar change into a butterfly? Metamorphosis, metamorphosis, it's a complete change of form. From a caterpillar to a butterfly, from a larva to a moth. Metamorphosis, metamorphosis, it's a complete change.